Oh yeah, new session. My favorite thing about new sessions is how much I definitely remember what was happening last time. What is this pile of sticks? Oh. Okay, goodbye. Goodbye, sticks. Did I do this already? Uh, yeah, we did this. Right. I actually remember specifically being like in a hurry to get out of here because I was I was I was late for something and I was like, uh, get out of there and the video. Uh, it, keeps, it keeps coming back. Okay, it just breaks. I don't know what that is. Oh no! Look! Look! Oh, that's what that was. The stuff I saw was was the sail of one of these guys being all destroyed and all that. Uh... Why? Wait, I'm confused. Oh no, now I have to be really paranoid about like places I've already been. Because instead of being full of just regular ass coins, now they're suddenly full of the purple coins. Which are unique and must be found. Oh, hey. Ow. That was the wrong trigger. Or, nope, the triggers don't do different things, do they? 28 out of 50. We're getting there. Not that it's that hard. It's in a very big area. What are you hiding from me, game? Ooh. Okay. <laughs> I mean, that's just a new secret. That's just a whole thing I never even found the first time around. I never won this particular platform, did I? Oh yeah, there they are. Oh, was he saying brother? Oh, bother. Bother! I suppose I must be getting work repairing this... Getting to work repairing this broken ship. It's all wrecked. How will we fix it at all? Point. Too many coins. Yeah, the fact that these, some of these places I've already been to are arbitrarily full of, like, purple coins now means I gotta be real careful. You never know or you might be missing something. Yeah, because why not? Got those already. <laughs> Look at what my hat has become. Just is a dry bones head, and his cr his freaky little eyes inhabit the eye sockets of the dead turtle's head. Ooh. Is that, is that a thing? Is that going to be a thing? I don't know what to think about that. That was startling. Huh. Before I go any further, I should probably try to spend some of these, right? Oopsie. Switch. Oh, that's a pretty good one. <laughs> the Bonneton Tower model. Plush frog. I've got to wear this costume. It's perfect. It's beautiful. Is there a party location? Normally this is like a party that you can only get into by wearing the right costume. So I'm curious about that now. Pretty much always just save the 25 for last. Because it makes it easier to get the 4 out of 5. And then I save the 25 as my last thing. Look at me. Am I beautiful? I'm beautiful. I'm perfect. Say, use this costume for the rest of the game. <laughs> no. Moon. Well, yes, I would like to have too many moons. Thank you. Yeah! Bloop. Not finding a lot. Thank you. 
Just to mess with me, everything respawns. Every time I want to go through and... Yeah. Every time I want to go through and make sure I get everything, that kind of stuff happens. Where it's like every... Every crate respawns and every coin respawns, and I'm like, I'll never, n I'll never feel completionist about it, anything. Uh oh. <laughs> yeah. Timer challenge one. What? What? Oh. I need you. Because these have a fixed height where they can only go X amount higher than where they started. But he can't get to that. But will it let me take him in there? Because if I get up there as one of these guys, I can fly over and get it. I can get it. I can do it. I can nail it. While I'm here, let's go around this tower just to make sure there's not something any, like hiding behind it, which I would totally expect to be a thing. Oh look, is that something hiding behind it? Who could have expected such a thing? Yep, alright. In we go. LBRB. Uh... <laughs> okay, this is an interesting idea for a challenge. It's like an instant death. It's a wave pool. Full of the instant death stuff. Specifically built around the weirdness that is this guy's mechanic. I like how he can only be a certain. He can fly, but only to a certain height compared. Oh. It is hard to judge the, like, the depth. The perspective is all crazy. There we go. Oh, you keep the ones you got already. Okay. So he has a fixed height based on how high he can go. And you can dip down and then you can get right back up to wherever you were. So you're safe. There we go. Da 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 da. Idea, idiot. That's an interesting idea. The wave pool. Yeah, skimming the poison tide. Oh. Now where am I, though? Oh, right back where I came from. Right, because that's how those hat doors work. They spit you right back out where you came from. I always do a crab claw pose with my hand thing. Where, like, I'll be pressing... I'm right now I'm pressing B with my index finger while using my thumb on the joystick to change the camera angle. Which is a strategy that I've always... I've, decided, I've, I've uh, established from... Dark Souls? Because I just, I can't give up camera control. I need camera control. So if you make me press A a lot, or whatever, to keep jumping, or in Dark Souls, if you make me hold down a button to run, I can't just, I can't bring myself to just steer with the left stick and wait for the camera to catch up. I, I need continuous and never ending camera controls. So I will do a weird crab claw pose just so that I can make sure that uh, I can steer the camera while also pressing or holding whatever the button they're making me use. Something that I just always end up doing. Nope. I'm out of here. Ah, there's more of them. Wondering where they're going to be hiding. That's a bunch of them, too. In this world in particular, the coin, the purple coins feel spammy. They put them all back to back. There we go. They put all the coins like right back to back and in really small areas. Because there's just very little world to put them in. But they felt like going to 50. They decided that 50 and 20 and 100 were the two numbers. Maybe there's a bigger one at some point, but the fact that they stuck to 50 here means it's probably not a smaller one. Bigger -er heart, yeah.
He's dead. He's dead and he's not coming back. This looks too heavy to move. I suppose we could just leave it there. How far away is the... Very far away. All right. Uh, how am I gonna get there? Is there Goomba? There Goomba ran. Ooh, that's new, right? I believe that's new. Ooh, it's one of them. Okay. I did it. Aha! I did it. My hat almost collected everything on its own, so that was. It's almost pointless. <laughs> Is there like a, a moon around here to make this challenging? I don't know. Let's, let's look around now that I'm safe. No? Yeah, th those didn't really pose much of a threat. Ooh. Oh, no! Why? Ah, why is it controlled that way? I pressed X and that let that made me get the coins. But I don't know why that but for some reason that also meant for some reason meant that I I guess also then had to jump off when I reached the end, which is not what I was going for. Oh, so that's just how- okay. Didn't know about that mechanic. But apparently that's just a thing. <laughs> apparently if you reach the end of the- Oh, that was weird. I did a butt pump, butt, butt stomp, then undid that and dashed, I guess. Okay. Uh, yeah, I had not taken stock of that mechanic until just now, but apparently when you uh, reach the end of the electricity- the electric wire, it just- you just- you just fall off. Which- has probably been happening the whole time. It's just I've never had to notice because I wasn't- it wasn't gonna kill me <laughs> until just now. All right. Uh, now we know. Hello. If you could politely give me a not-death platform, please. Yes? Yes. There we go. Well, thank you for your assistance, sir. You just shake that controller. Woohoo! Oh, that was almost almost in trouble there. Almost in trouble there. That's going fast now. Oh, it's going fast now. Oh, it's going fast now. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Cool. We're good. Everything's fine. Yep. There we go. All right. Now I get to chill out for a second. Oh, look at him. You, you okay, Mario? You alright? Yeah, I'm a little worried about him. I'm a little worried about Mario. I have no idea what the... That's the weirdest mechanic. There we go. Haha. -ha. But where was the secret moon? Isn't there always a secret moon? I don't know, I can't look around manually with a camera. I don't know. I didn't see one. This place probably doesn't have that many moons, so maybe it doesn't have one, but I don't think I trust it. <laughs> oh, look, we can get in there now. Yeah, when I realized that stuff was revamping over time, I did not initially come to the conclusion that, that like, oh, that must mean, oh, just turning all these on. Ooh, maybe, this, maybe turning all these on does something. What's that little fellow up to? Maybe turning on every single light makes something happen. Or maybe turning every single light on just makes me feel good on the inside. I'll also accept that answer. It could be it could be a moon, potentially. 
I mean, what make what is or isn't a moon is just the most arbitrary stuff. If it's anything like Koroks, nothing so far though. Hey, can somebody give me a, a Goomba? Somebody give me a Goomba? Oh hey, die! I bought your game and then they made a better version on the Switch like a month later. God. Damn it, so I have to buy it again before I do it? Because why would I do the Wii U version if you went and made a Switch one immediately? Thanks. <laughs> I climbed all the way up here because I wanted to see that big moon up close. I'm still not very close, but I found a power moon along the way, so here. Moon! It's a moon. Mario? The moon's so pretty, I can't stop looking at it. How do I get that moon over there? It's very far away. Huh. So I can't reach it with the other Goombas. As far as I can tell. And there's no additional boss fight up here or anything. Alright. Wee! He's fine, he's Mario. So if the Goomba can't reach it, I must be able to get there with the frog. And there must be like invisible things for me to jump into. So let's try that idea. I'll probably go on top of those buildings as a frog and then I'll probably find secrets. Was that not there before? Because it wasn't activated? I don't know. I'm just really satisfied to find out that if you if you hat these things, they turn on. I, I like turning on a series of lights in places. It just seems neat. All right, let's book it. Only seven to go. I wonder where they where they are. Uh oh. Okay. my frag what could I do to go even higher that doesn't make me go much higher I don't think I can do like a double jump or an extra jump or anything. And the frog just does not quite reach it. But I can't like stack a Goomba and frog effect as far as I can, as far as I'm aware. Like I, I'm stuck with just the frog, I believe. The question is, can I make the frog jump higher? Or is there some other secret? I don't think that's possible. Hmm. Well, previously with this Goomba, I destroyed these boxes, so maybe if I land on top of these boxes, I can go a little higher. Are these boxes the highest point, really? Alright. What if I land here? There you go. Hmm. 
I'm looking for anything that's higher than these boxes to make up the difference. Yeah, because that's definitely not high enough. But maybe if I got to my own sale. I don't know about that. I need a height boost. You could give me a hand. Oh. You can go through it. Okay, so that probably means you can't land on top of it. Shit. I was gonna try that. <laughs> I thought maybe you can land on top of this and then jump up from it, and that'll give you give you a height boost. Just anything to work with here. Just give me a hand. I'm looking at that platform in the background, and it looks like it's probably about the same height as the one that I came from in the first place, which makes sense because I've already flown there before. Cannot do like the Mario triple jump with the with the frog. So there's no way to make the frog jump higher that way at least. There's no double jump. I don't think mashing jump or Yeah, I don't know. I think I'm gonna head head out for now. We'll see. We'll see if I come up with a trick in the future that allows that kind of move. Cause I don't. I don't know what to do. We got more moons. Hundred and thirty-six. Time to go to Uncanny Van Va Uncan uh, Uncanny Valleysville. That's that's the place to call it. Now I got my dinosaur stamp and I got my hat stamp. Let's go off to a place where people are too real and it's worrying and I don't know what to think about it. Let's go to New Dank City. Seeing as how we got some time to kill, let's read some useful skills. Ground pound jump. If you want to get high on a regular jump and then the ground pound, you can jump afterwards and it goes higher. Goodness, what was that? We get to do like a cloud level. We're not ready. Hmm. Should I expect moons here or or should I just expect this to be a once off level that maybe you can't even come back to after that? Hello. It looks like a memory phone bed. Yeah, it looks like a memory phone bed. Uh, might just be a boss chamber or something. Hmm. 
Mario, I don't have time for you. I'm busy planning my wedding. Don't you know how stressful it is? your hat being a weapon kind of overkill when you're also that big this is just all right all right the plan you've got here bowser uh, he covers some ground he's really big uh -huh. uh -huh. <laughs> ow i didn't see the fire coming ow <laughs> I'm gonna beat you up with your own hat I bet you regret having a spike arena now. Really self-induced, isn't it? It was your choice to put that here. Uh oh. Uh oh. If you can conjure fake hats that I can't even hit back, why don't you just attack me with those? Just seems like a better idea. Hee <laughs> hee. Come here, Bowser. Oh. <laughs> what was that? Bam! That looks... That looks really painful. Are you alright? I'm sorry. Oh boy. Oh boy. Huh? Woohoo! <gasps> Get! Oh, had that... Wait, did I accidentally destroy his hat? His fake hat? Did it give me a heart? I didn't, I didn't think I could destroy them. Oh! What is he even throwing at me? What, where's that coming from? Ooh. Oh, really? It's a thing? I can lose the boxing match? Woohoo! Woohoo! Yep! Yeah! That's a fun boss design. So what's his excuse? He's going so slow. Whoa, this is a new one. Wait, are they, uh, is this... Is this game just gonna perpetually taunt me with New Dong City and not actually send me to it for the longest time? We've got... This is our second surprise location on the way there. Uh, where are we now? Oh no, the Odyssey's all busted up. We needed some power moons to fix it. Let's get go let's get looking. Yeah, that's not much of a surprise. All right. Ooh. That's a hell of a bloom. 